We say no to APGPN, we say no to UAG, we say yes to government committees. We all heard about Theophilus when he was arrested by EFCC. Theophilus came out and said he has no money to this boss. No money anywhere. Wish everybody that subscribed into Theobat's grant knows that it's commerce. But the Theophilus we are talking about is outside still collecting money in the name of that is grant again to this boss. The same masses Tophilos told that there is no money to this boss. Is the, they are the same masses that is re- doing new regulation now. They are still collecting money up to this moment. So tell me if your press conference will work. This is Nigeria. And coming out to demand money from the masses. Are you who say you are you are fighting for the masses? And this mass we are talking about, they are passing through our ship. Some them will go and borrow money. So press conference, all these things can never work in Nigeria. They are they, someone was arrested. And he, he said he, he said it publicly. He told the FCC he has no money, no money anywhere to this boss. And this same person was released and he was still collecting money up to up to now. So tell me how press conferences want to work. So I told him that what we need is to know the 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 government committees. That's the only thing that can save us. That's the only thing that show us the truth. Why are we dragging ourselves? Good morning everyone in Grant Community. This is the voice of Chief Kari Tajidina Jaidi Akogun Agbekoya Worldwide. I give glory to Almighty God for giving me another opportunity to be among the living today. And I appreciate all Grant Fighters that believe in my leadership. May the Lord bless you all. I'm out this morning because of the VN that I listen to addressing to me direct from one Mr. Daniel in the airport. A member or I don't know ESCO of a platform named MFM. Firstly I want to advise all grant fighters in grant community whatever you want to do in life always pray for God's wisdom wisdom is very important in human life fighting with that wisdom will lead you to destruction on our telegram channel yesterday we held a meeting that ends successfully in that meeting i said we are not fighting agpgn and we are not fighting uaag i address my people that whosoever in with us that are still standing for the two parties should please remove him, himself from our platform even though you want to fight or maybe you you are a fans of APGPN or UAG do it on the ground don't bring it outside don't bring it to our platform and um, I said the only thing that can help us is to see the government committee have meeting with them for us to know where we are we say no to APGPN we say no to UAG we say yes to government committees because our belief is that 
they are the one that's causing problem up to this moment that you have not gotten this money that's the reason why we said we want to see them have meeting with them to know the time we are going to get the money so that we can come back to tell the masses and i said in my being uh, in the meeting yesterday that whatever we want to do you must carry the masses along they must have and in it because if we do it on our own they can castigate us against the masses the people you claim you are fighting for my turn to be your enemy and at the end of the day they will go after you as we are talking we gave a lot of people a uh, chance to, to speak their to their mind you know as a leader i listened to mr tom tom who said during the verification he left lagos to abuja that same month during the verification when he was in abuja in abuja he lost his first son 27 years old and his mother at the same time and uh, assuming he was around he could have rescued them my my in fact i'm not happy to hear that and uh, uh i raised alarm i said okay if that should be the case the pastor from Redeem who introduced the government committee to both APGBN and UAG management will come out today to give him 48 hours for him to let us have access to the government committee. Failure to do that, we will write letter to Redeem Camp National and Fillion for Redeem Camp National to listen to us will go out for protest in Redeem Camp. And uh, we have not concluded. What I said is that whatever we want to do, the masses must know about it and the masses must put hand into it. I did not say we are going there. We ju I just raised the suggestion that for us to quickly see those people because he was the one that introduced them to APGPN and UAG. Why is he hard for him to introduce us to them too? For us to have meeting with them to know the truth. You know, someone said in the meeting there is no money. We disagree with the person. Now why will you say there is no money? APGPN can never deceive us to that extent, telling us there is money to this boss. And someone will not come out there is no money. Because APGPN, they are for the masses. But for us to know because of today, tomorrow, next tomorrow, we are tired about it. For some of us to come in, to know the truth about this government NGO, this authority that is holding this government from October till now, we are in the quarter of it this year. And that meeting, The guy that called himself Prince of Wallis raised an alarm that uh, um, press conference is the solution and uh, he challenged me some uh, that I did not support them, this and that. And I respond, 
to his message. If press conference is the answer, we all had the history. We all had about Theophilus when he was arrested by EFCC. Theophilus came out and said he has no money to this boss. No money anywhere. Which everybody that subscribed into Theobard's grant knows that is scammers. But the tell the Theophilus we are talking about is outside still collecting money in the name of that is grant again to this boss. The same masses Tophilos told that there is no money to this boss. Is this, they are the same masses that is reg, doing new regulation now. They are still collecting money up to this moment. So tell me if your press conference will work. This is Nigeria. And coming out to demand money from the masses. Are you people say you are you are fighting for the masses? And this mass we are talking about, they are passing through our ship. So then we go and borrow money. So press conference, all these things can never work in Nigeria. They are they, someone was arrested. And he, he said he, he said it publicly. He told the FCC he has no money, no money anywhere to this boss. And this same person was released and he was still collecting money up to, up to now. So tell me how press conferences want to work. So I told him that what we need is to know the, the, the government committees. That's the only thing that can save us. That's the only thing that show us the truth. Why are we dragging ourselves? It's a simple thing. Who are the government committees? For if the pastor can be able to introduce them to APGPN and UAG, why we can't have access to them? Are we not human beings? Are we not up to be people that can have sit down and have meeting with them? So that's the reason why I'm saying this: that if you what you what call yourself agitator, go and pray for wisdom. Now. Mr. Abba now came out and I said that we should march to uh, the church of Apostle Ken. How? Is that the first thing to do when they told us that it's money? It is when we finally confirm there is no money anywhere to be given to us. Then we now take another action. And the action we take will be an action, an agreement with everyone in that community. We we'll carry ourselves along. But they say there is money, and the people that we, we that we disburse this money, they are the government committee, and they they have never come out and said there is no money. And we are demanding that we are the government committees. Let's see them. Let's talk with them. Let's know our fate. It gets to a point when someone still says something that was, I said, why is it that four people will hold our destiny in Nigeria? Only four people that if they cook for us, we will eat finish. But if we come together and cook for them, they can't finish it. Now, are we stupid? Four people holding our destiny. Apostle Ken, Pastor John Oloyo, Pastor Amukita, and uh, 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 President, uh, uh, President of APGBN, um, Abdul, aka Jamashin, four of them are holding our destiny in Nigeria. 50 million people, four people are holding the destiny of 50 million people. I was so surprised that this man, the only area he picked is that area of we are going to. Uh, they do protest in uh, Redeem, but the protest should start from Apostle Ken Church. Apostle Ken has never come out and said that the government committee that they are working with say there is no money. APG has never come out and said the government committee they are working with say there is no money to this boss. 
they, what they told us that the government committee they are under the authority of the government committee i want to see the authority even though when people are saying protest i say no the protest we are talking about first thing is to see the authority first but if they disagree and they refuse for us to see the authority then we will not take second plan which i said the pastor that introduced them can be able to to write letter to to uh, 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 redeem national body like i call him to show us who are the government committees at least even though he has power on us he has no power on redeem uh, 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 national they will call him as a pastor and he will respond so i don't know we are the problem of ourselves in grand community we are the problem of ourselves if we don't know uh, how to agitate go and sit down that's why i'm calling all the admins don't allow every vn in your platform don't allow every vn in your platform the uh, mr Pax, pascal came out and said by next week everything is going to be all right that we should come down and the government committees are the one that owns the money even though Admi Moses told me, and he was the one to say that that said that the money is in the hand of the government, that they are the one that are holding disbursement. And the man, anytime you you call him, even though he's sleeping, he will tell you it's, it's government. And these are the government we are we are we are talking about. Let's see them first. And if they now come out and say there is no money, then we take action. Why do you say we should go and? and destroy someone's church he didn't tell us there is no money they said there is money so going to the church is the one is, is he going to give us the money because the reason why i mentioned that is because the government committee we are talking about this is the pastor was the one that brought them in let's see them let's see people that uh, 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 that hold the destiny of 50 million nigerians And I said in my VN, uh, in, in the meeting yesterday, that both APGN and uh, UAG don't know what is coming, coming on their way. If finally they disagree, showing us the government committee, because we have military backup. We have military backup. Thank God in the meeting, you people had the voice of the man that talked to us. A lot of militaries, a lot of them are in this system. They also subscribe. They are subscribers. And they gave us their support. So I don't know the reason why someone would just come out and started throwing a kind of a question. So what we are asking the uh, masses for for them to join us to, to, to join with us to join and with us is the government committee for now we want to talk to them want to have meeting with them we if uh, we, we we are ready we don't fear anybody expect except almighty god we fear nobody except almighty god don't say if we go they will arrest us let them come and arrest us or let them kill us because we demand for our right so four people cannot hold our destiny and this one will come out we say i fight for i'm fighting for APGP, and this one will come and say i'm fighting for uag why this point of time let's stop it what we are expecting is not fighting don't let us promote fighting in our platforms what we need is disbursement that is the answer we want to see the government committee enough is enough that is all i have to say this morning god bless nigerian bye for now